2015 is a significant year for the Teze community, which is an ecumenical monastic order. They will be celebrating 100 years since the birth of their founder, Brother Roger. But 2015 also marks 10 years since his assassination. There were 3,000 people in the church and uh, an ill person was coming, but very calmly, very silently, was coming close to him and took a knife and cut the throat. So he lost uh, he, uh, a lot of blood and he died very quickly. And this violent death was terrible for us. But it was also a shock that put us together, that united all the brothers and that we knew immediately now we all have to continue what Brother Roger started in Tese. Brother Roger started a small monastic community in the French village of Tese during World War II. It would eventually become an ecumenical group uniting Catholics and Protestants across Europe. The organization now has a presence in 30 countries. Uh, it was wartime, but he said, I want to start a community in a difficult situation. There is so much violence and Christians are fighting against each other. And this was his vision in the beginning, to form a small community of Christians from different backgrounds, different churches, who live reconciliation and peace. The community has just 100 people, but much larger groups come to prayer meetings. Late last year, 30,000 people, most of them young, joined the community to pray together in Prague. But they don't belong to our community. We don't create a movement of young people. They just are there for one week and then they go. And we tell them, go back to your parish. Go back to, there is the place. And don't refer to Tese, but to your parish. Brother Alua met twice with Pope Francis, and during his trip to Turkey, the Pope highlighted the importance of the movement. Penso ad esempio alle moltitudini di giovani ortodossi, cattolici e protestanti che si incontrano nei raduni internazionali organizzati dalla comunità di Tese. Sono loro che oggi ci sollecitano a fare passi in avanti verso la piena comunione. E ciò non perché essi ignorino il significato delle differenze che ancora ci separano, ma perché sanno vedere oltre, sanno vedere oltre, sono capaci di cogliere l'essenziale che già ci unisce. August 16th will mark the 10th anniversary of Brother Roger's death. Pope Francis will join a prayer organized by the Teze community on that day. The community is also organizing other meetings throughout the year. In the summer, they will commemorate the organization's 75th anniversary and the 100th anniversary of Brother Roger's birth.